Katie Shepard was born a micro preemie weighing only one pound, 13 ounces. Her first week of life, she developed sepsis and a collapsed lung. Spending weeks in two hospitals, Katie was diagnosed cerebral palsy. Doctors said that Katie was most likely blind and would probably never walk. Dr. Robert Bruce started Katie with physical therapy and at age three, Botox injections in both legs. With the shots, braces, and intensive therapy, Katie began to walk unassisted. In fifth grade, Katie was also diagnosed with a form of autism called Asperger's syndrome. Think these challenges might just be too much for a young girl? Not for Katie. She excelled in school, received numerous awards, and that girl who was never supposed to walk? Well, she was a cheerleader and played softball. Katie began dance class, and when studio owner Tiffany suggested she dance to a Rick Springfield song, she became an instant fan. Making many more friends in the Rick Springfield fan community, she then met Claire Springfield. No relation, long story. As a gift, Claire went in with Katie's parents to buy her a soundcheck pass, the opportunity to meet her idol, Rick Springfield. It was my honor to fly to Atlanta for a few hours to meet Katie and to capture some of her special moments on camera. Her first experience with the rock star was as precious as she is. He, with his great big heart, was so good with her. Such a sweet girl, such an inspiration. As you're about to see, love is a healer. Katie, yeah. are you excited? Very. <laughs> What's your favorite Rick Springfield song? I don't have a favorite. You no. don't? I like them all. <laughs> Is that what you're going to say to him if he asks you? Yeah. Are you going to be shy in front of him? I don't know. I seriously hope I don't freak out. You think you're going to freak out? I do. No, you won't. Take your time.